Hi Sagittarius, it's Elle here to do your November 2018 general reading. Um, it's a general read, so it will not resonate with each and every Sagittarius who views the video. But if it does resonate with you, please like, share, comment, sub subscribe to the channel. It's much appreciated. Whoa, okay. We're going to start off with Sagittarius singles. Um... What's the energy from our Sagittarius couples? Alright. Bottom of the deck, the Ten of Air. It says some of you could be dealing with Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Uh, doesn't have to be, but there just is an ultimate end. And this is the culmination of, like, this, this just, just doesn't happen. It's not all of a sudden. You knew that something was coming to an end. It still hurts, though. It still, some people feel blindsided, backstabbed, betrayed. Um, more so because they were trying to suppress this ending or, or prolong it. But now it's, it's complete. Let's see, for the singles, we've got the hangman, the seven of water. All right. So for the singles, of course, you could be dealing with the Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. We have Pisces here. Um, you might just be in limbo. Or, and or just letting things happen naturally. Doing very, very little. And also allowing people to show you who they are by way of their actions in in the midst of you're keeping your options open and for some of you this may be a spouse or a significant other who is who may be cheating or there might be some infidelity there's somebody who makes promises just to break them. This could be this Piscean person. They create illusions and disillusionment. You could be doing this Sagittarius or vice versa. Um, some of you have, you know, analysis paralysis. Like you're not making a decision about something. Uh, because, you know, there's emotional confusion. You don't know which way to go. So you're at the hangman status. Just kind of letting things go as they will. All right, coupled. Sagittarius. Nice. We got the two of water and the page of earth. So, um. This could be couples having a baby or, um. Starting over it could be with Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, Capricorn, Virgo, Taurus. Starting anew here. Um, something ended, or something has has to end. Maybe somebody's putting away the past in a relationship. The Queen of Clubs popping out. Let's see. This is something happened within in the relationship for some of you, and and somebody wants to start over. Capricorn, Virgo, Taurus, because they understand that this this is a real connection. Um, yeah, there was like the ultimate betrayal here, possibly. And for some of you, it's just this is like newness within a relationship, an established relationship new baby new home starting something new i don't know it's something new here all right what do we have to say for my single pisces single oh, definitely dealing with a piscean person my single sagittarius you've got somebody very much in love with you may even be a little obsessed yep and then there's you 
they either want the situation to completely transform or this sits on you. You may even want it to end. Like, you're okay with it ending. And you're doing nothing about even trying to save it. Because I feel as if it's something you... A relationship, a situation, whatever, a business. You don't want. You don't care to have. It can, it can go. It can stay. You just don't care. The two of water and the page of earth for my couple Sagittarius. The five of... Yeah. So, like, there, there could have been heavy arguing. There could have been interference from maybe a third party. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Could be family. Could be friends. But there's interference that brings about heavy indecision and arguing. If someone wants to start over, you know, let's let's start this again because we have a connection. You know, let's get back on track. Yeah. Um, because they really want to establish something long term and stable here. Somebody wants that with you, but they're also um. They have high anxiety around the relationship. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Someone had a baby. There might even be low energy, negativity, extreme, extreme pain and loss here. But someone still is willing to fight for the connection. Okay. Could be a Capricorn, Virgo, Taurus. So we are going to clarify over at the website to um, see what this is all about. See a potential outcome. Let's get a butterfly oracle card and then close out. Thank you. Messages for Sagittarius. leaving <laughs> okay some of you like you, the death card here the ace of space somebody wants to leave something or a situation or leave something behind ten of air the death card yeah you know. I mean you could be physically leaving moving uh, you could be spiritually emotionally energetically moving away from a particular situation grief yeah, grief work. So for some of you, for the my couple, Sagittarius, like somebody's hurt. Somebody was or still is hurt. Lots of grief. Lots of hurt here. The Ten of Air also. Um, I need to go through the process before just trying to bury the feelings and start anew with the Page of Earth. Go through the process. Some of you guys who are a couple need to go to couples counseling. Or you have done that or you will. Right. Family changes. Um, some, like I said, some of you having a baby. Buying a home. Starting, starting a family. It's just family changes here. And then some of you, there's heavy grief, but you still want the relationship or someone still wants the relationship with you, Sagittarius. Let's clarify over at the website. The link is below. It's $1.50 to get a potential outcome. Thank you for tuning in. Make sure you're commenting below. Um, if you can't at all make any kind of um, purchase at this time, do what is free. Go ahead and click that subscribe button. Click the like button. It's much appreciated. Know that I'm praying for you, Sagittarius. Pray for me as well. Take care, guys.